What is happening, Captain? It's the Shoe Bully coming at you with review number three. Today we got the Kanye West sneakers, the Adidas 350 Boost V2. Uh, let's go ahead and get straight into it. As you can see, the uh, upper is made out of like a knitted mesh. It's got the zebra print on there. It's not really that soft, but it feels really durable, like it would last a long time. Um, you got the blue uh heel tab with the orange and red stitching on there and then you got to follow with the orange and red supply 350 on there uh weird weird color to choose for them i'm not sure how i feel about that uh, the blue tint is mostly accentuated in the sock liner right there and then on the laces they look like they were washed with like a fresh pair of blue jeans or something um and then the midsole has like a hovercraft type feel, like a Marvin the Martian Jetsons type futuristic shoe. Uh, I know y'all get that vibe. And then if you look real close, it's uh, two different colors. It's like a yellowish. This almost looks like it glows in the dark, but unfortunately it doesn't. We just checked it and uh, it doesn't glow in the dark. So uh, quality, I went with an 8 out of 10 on these just because uh, there's a few glue stains on them. Uh, see them right there just a little bit and uh, also it didn't glow in the dark and that was just an automatic point off for me just because it looks like it glows in the dark why doesn't it glow in the dark so let's go on to the next one uh, durability I went with a 7 out of 10 just because the rubber on this midsole it feels pretty soft like it'll wear down pretty quick uh, and then you got that big open exposed boost I mean as you step on a stick the wrong way, go through that boost and ruin your whole day. Um, let's see, comfort, 10 out of 10, cause it's a boost. And this material is better than memory foam. I mean, it's, it's super comfortable. Everybody's raving about it in the sneaker scene. Uh, versatility, I went with a five out of 10, just cause uh, you have to wear skinny jeans with this shoe, man. You can't, you can't be rocking some boot cut Levi's with these, man. You're gonna look like an idiot. Mm. Like, you have to wear uh, skinny jeans with these, and that's just, that's not, that's not very versatile to me, you know what I mean? So, rockability, I'm gonna have to go with like a 6 out of 10, just because, you know, it's a unique shoe, man. Like, you're really gonna have to find the right outfit for these. Especially, and it's got so many colors on it. It's just, I, I don't know, man. I don't know how I feel about this shoe, to be honest with y'all. Uh, and then, hype level, of course. 10 out of 10, because everybody wants these shits. They're the hottest on the market. Everybody wants the Yeezys. I don't know why, honestly, because they look like Scoob Steve sneakers to me. But, you know, to each their own, man. Everybody can rock what they like. I'll never hate another man's style. Today, we also got these in. Another shipment from Adidas. Go ahead and break into them. Got the Tamper Evident tape on there. About to bust the seal. Another one. Another one. What is it? Oh, it's another one. <laughs> but yeah, man. Uh, one thing I will say about Adidas and compared to Nike, uh, I really hate how they ship. As you can see, I just opened that from the uh, from the Adidas store. And it was just a box in a box, man. And I waited about two weeks to get these. Two weeks. Like, that's way too long, man. Nobody wants to wait two weeks after they spent 230 something dollars. Like, nobody wants to do that. Uh, if you buy, buy a pair of shoes from Nike, you get them in two days, three days max. And, you know, it's not a box in a box. It's, you got the bubble wrap. You got good packing material in there. You know, Adidas was just like, here's your shoes. Fuck off. And, you know, that's kind of unprofessional to me. But, uh, all right, that's pretty much all I got for y'all today. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and hit that little dinger so you get notifications when I make new videos. Uh, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And check out our new website, sneaker.farm. We got some sneakers up there. We, the, the prices are a little high right now because I'm still messing with eBay, but we're going to get them down to where they're supposed to be. Uh, and don't forget to subscribe to all of my social medias at the Shoe Bully. And that's all I got. Peace, y'all. And uh, don't forget to subscribe. Oh, life. God.
Alright. That's pretty much all I got for y'all today. Uh, I forgot everything that I was going to say, but it's okay. We're going to try it again.